Hey guys, welcome back to the Grow Operation. Thanks for joining me today. What I'm gonna take you through is how to spot an iron deficiency and uh, what you do to fix it. So let's get into it. So what you've got here is a Chinese broccoli plant. Uh, I've started this about three weeks ago and it's just starting to show signs of uh, iron deficiencies. Now I've started a new system and uh, I've, uh, uh, usually you come across iron as your first, uh, first deficient uh, nutrient and so I thought this would be a great time to show you what it looks like. So if you can see the leaves on the new growth is sort of starting to yellow and growth has essentially stopped. This is typical iron deficiency. It can look a lot like a nitrogen deficiency in that it goes yellow on the center and growth can slow. But, but with one major difference that I usually notice, depending on the plant, is that with the nitrogen, de nitrogen deficiency, the entire center of, of the plant uh, and the leaves will go yellow, where with iron, you'll see that the veins will sort of remain green, and in between the veins is where it sort of starts to turn yellow. And so that's how you tell the difference between a nitrogen and an iron deficiency. They can look very similar. Um, one more thing too, it's uh, you, you're very rarely going to have a nitrogen deficiency. Uh, if, you, if you do find that you are uh, uh, lacking in nitrogen, it's usually probably a pH problem rather than actual nitrogen. That's just the nature of the beast with aquaponics. Uh, yeah, great. Now I'll show you what I do to fix the problem. So this is the iron that I use when I'm fixing the deficiencies that I've got. Uh, now the important thing to take uh, notice of is the EDTA. That, I'm not sure exactly what it means, but uh, what it means for us in this uh, circumstance is that it's soluble in water and it's easily taken up by the plants. Now to fix the problem you saw, what I'm going to do is uh, my tank in that aquaponics unit is 50 litres and I'm going to put about a quarter of a mil in there. Um, so not much. Then I'm going to wait for about uh, a week to see if there's any signs of it uh, correcting and then I may add some more. But don't add in heaps and then, then expect it to happen straight away because it does take a little bit of time. So don't rush in and give it that amount every day or anything like that because that'll be way too much. So look, I hope you've uh, learned something and uh, if it's been helpful, hit subscribe. Thanks for watching and I'll see you next time.